do this? 1. Answer the following questions. Conceptual understanding. 1. Define A. Vaccines B. Immunization Answer A. Vaccines The protective substances which are introduced into the body to create immunity against certain diseases are called vaccines. Vaccines are introduced into the body through vaccination or inoculation. B. Immunization The process of creating artificial immunity by introducing immunizing agents or vaccines into the body against certain infectious diseases through vaccination or inoculation is called immunization. 2. What precautions are to be taken to avoid infectious diseases? Answer. We must take certain precautions to avoid infectious diseases. The person suffering with the disease should be separated from healthy individuals. The persons who attend the patient should wash their hands clean with soap and water. The utensils and clothes used by the patient should be boiled and dried in the sun. The drinking water should be boiled, cooled and used. 3. What are the symptoms of polio? Answer. Polio starts with cold or sore throat, fever, headache, vomiting, pain, and tenderness of the muscles of the limbs are the important symptoms. Sometimes it results in paralysis of limbs which remains lifelong. 4. Write about the preventive measures of diphtheria. Answer. Diphtheria can be prevented by timely vaccination. Three DPT injections are given at monthly intervals during the first year of the child. Booster dose is given after two and a half years age. The preventive medicine is the DPT vaccine. 5. What is triple vaccine? Answer. Vaccines of diphtheria, whooping cough and tetanus are combined together as a triple antigen vaccine called in short DPT. 6. How does diarrhea spread? Answer. Diarrhea spreads by eating the fruits and vegetables without cleaning. By collecting and eating the food left on the soil. By eating stale food or the foods kept unprotected for a longer time. By drinking contaminated water. Fill in the blanks. Conceptual understanding. Three. Write T for true and F for false statements. Conceptual understanding. Four, project work. Ask the students to visit a primary health center and observe 
how the vaccinations are given to the children. Consult their elders in their family and collect the information regarding the dates during which the different vaccinations are given to the children in their family and note the information in their project book. Seventh, 